what is the role of leadership in not only implementation, which I think you touched on, but also sustainability of this dojo model within an organization? Yes. So it, it really, really starts with leadership. So we, we actually have full leadership dojos, meaning we've worked with organizations to get their leadership aligned at the top level before they go into any type of team level execution dojos. So that could look like, you know, how do we really lead in a modern product centric environment? How do we think about our new product taxonomy? How does our communication and leadership style really need to evolve with this change? So, it, and if it's more at the team level, we're making sure that the leaders are involved from an organizational change management perspective. So we really want them to do a few things. We want them to, one, set the stage and the foundation for, hey, teams, we're going through a dojo. More importantly, here's why we're doing it. Here's how we're going to engage. And here's all of the expected, all the expectations for you as a learner coming through their dojos. The second piece is we want them actively engaged. So we run, in, mo in most cases, we'll have sprint reviews. Depending on the product that the organization is building, it could be cloud, it could be something on the DevOps side, whatever it is. We want the leaders to attend those so they can see the actual value that their teams are building in the dojo because we're challenging the teams to deliver and build in a different way. And we want the leaders to actually see that and provide feedback. So we always say that we, we don't just want the teams going through the dojo because we, we actually had that very early on where we built helped to build some very high performing teams and the leader wasn't connected. So when the leader, you know, got back in touch with the team after going through the dojo six to 12 weeks later, they're like, wow, this is a whole different team. I'm not really sure how to lead these folks. And so for that reason, we started having the leaders be a part of it, you know, being respectful of their time, but making sure that they understand how to lead kind of in this new way of working.